Hey guys, Stephanie here again. Um, just wanted to do a uh, candle collection for you guys. Um, this is all of my candles. So this is um, Kringle, I have Bath and Body, I have Homeworks, I have Candleberry, and I think that's it. So um, let me just turn the camera around and we'll get started for you guys, okay? Um, so in this drawer here is where I store a lot of my candles. So I tried to set this up by like theme, uh, but you know, didn't really work. All right, so on the top is my pumpkin stuff. So I've got my um, spiced white pumpkin here. Um, I think in the back, hold on a second. In the back is just some um, wall, wall stuff. Um, so my spiced white pumpkin, I have toasted. I think I have four of those, yes. I love these, you guys. A toasted vanilla pumpkin. Anything vanilla, y'all, I'm down for. Um, we've got, oh, let's put that there. All right, so we've got farm stand pumpkin. I've got pumpkin caramel corn. Um, in the back is more farm stand. And then Harvest Bake Shop. I don't think I burned Harvest Bake Shop last season, so I'm excited to do that one. I've got the Spooky Cider Halloween Candy. And in the back, more Halloween Candy. I've got Spooky Vanilla. Um, two of those, so one here, and then there's one in the back as well and then I've got the two um, witches brew I think is what it's called which is spell two of those um, down here is country candle candy cane lane and cozy cabin um, I'm realizing I'm not a huge fan of peppermint when it's burned um, I don't know something about it We'll see. Um, this was part of their Kringles Halloween collection last year. Um, so I've got Nevermore, which I truly love. I wish I would have gotten more. Um, this is like a, oh, this is honey. I love it. Um, Nevermore. So I burnt through some of it um, and didn't want to burn through any more. Wanted to save it. I know it's silly. Um, so Graveyard Night, Nevermore, Candy Corn, um, this one, oh, I wish I would have picked more up. I can't find this anywhere. Holiday Spice, that's beautiful, spicy, Christmassy. Um, and then we have Spiked Eggnog. Um, here I've got Christmas Morning and candy cane martini in the same back here it's just a double here i have winter fireside actually which can go down here because looks like i have plenty looks like i have five of that scoot that scooch it on over so, um, back to up here, I've got Christmas Cupcake. Looks like I've got, I've got two of those. I've got a French Eggnog Toast and four Christmas Cappuccinos. These are really light. Um, I was kind of disappointed in the throw. Um, it just wasn't very strong and it didn't throw very well. Um... I'm hoping this year um, Harry will increase the oils that he used because I was kind of disappointed in that. Everyone was, on, last year was like the first year I really, really started buying these candles and because I just kept hearing how great they were 
and I was really kind of disappointed in the throw. They smell fantastic, but the throw, the strength and throw while they're burning just wasn't my favorite. So, um, okay, we're going to come down here. So these are my, the five winter firesides. I really did enjoy that. Um, Mountain Weekend, it's okay. I got it on, like, I love the picture. If I could be in a cabin right now with snow, if this could be where I was at, I would be happy. So I kind of, you know, I love that vibe. That's kind of how our house is decorated in a kind of rustic cabin. Um, balsam white birch. Um, I do like a smoky charred wood smell. And that's kind of the vibe that these give. Um, okay, so we've got some more Kringle. This is part of their, their fall um, Christmas. So I've got a cozy cabin. I've got a Christmas cabin. Do you guys see the theme here? <laughs> um, I've got sugar pumpkin. And I've got cashmere and cocoa. That one's a good one. That's just a nice chocolatey, cozy feel. Um, this is more of their Halloween collection. So, um, Scarecrow, um, Apparition. I did, I think, so I did do, I burnt through Candy Corn. So, that one. And then I did burn through, like I said, the Nevermore. That one was really good. Um, so I've got two Hocus Pocus. I've got Pandora's box. There's Lady Darkness back there. Vampire. That one, I went through one whole thing of that and I do have another one. Um, Vampire. Sleepy Hollow. That's another one I burnt through that I enjoyed. So that's that collection, I'm gonna put that up there. Cause these will stay, but it always scares me. Um, okay, and then down here at the bottom is my slowly dwindling, not really replacing um, my Bath and Body Works. So Gooey Marshmallow, I think this was two years ago. Um, Paris Cafe, anything coffee and creamy, um, I'm enjoying tremendously. So there's a bunch of that. White Pumpkin, also a perfect one. I've got Smoked Vanilla here. Marshmallow Fireside. Regular Fireside back there. Beautiful container. Um... These are all Marshmallow Fireside here. Paris Cafe and Marshmallow Fireside. Coffee and Whiskey. This one is kind of light. I was surprised. Um, it's good. It's not bad. It was just kind of light. Um, perfect Christmas. Perfect Christmas. I do enjoy those. It is the perfect Christmas. Kind of reminds me of when I was little. And my mom would take the Christmas decorations out. And just that that smell of um, the cinnamon. I don't know, something about it. It's just, this is, I enjoy the perfect Christmas. Pumpkin clove, can never go wrong with that. Um, hot cocos and cream, that one is actually, should go up to my daughter's room. This is the one she likes a lot. And take that out. Um, so more perfect Christmas, more marshmallow fireside, and perfect Christmas. I've got pumpkin vanilla cream. Um, this one I burnt a lot last year I and the year before. I do really like that. Um, this is the um, that limited, um, you could only pick up one per customer, candied maple bacon. Um, I like it. I haven't burnt it. I should probably burn it just to burn it. Um, I don't know why I'm holding on to it. Um, it smells good. I'm excited. I do want to burn it just to see what it smells like. Um, pumpkin carving. This was last year's part of their Halloween collection fall. Campsite coffee, which I just found out. I was holding on to this. This was probably three or four years old. I was holding on to this because I was hoping that they would come out with that again. And I just found out 
that it is Paris Cafe. So I can burn this, which I'm happy about. Um, there's pumpkin clove, pumpkin carving, alpine frost, pumpkin clove, fall farmhouse. Um, so that is it for that drawer. And then I'm going to go down here. So down here is where I have, I got this last year, probably September, August or September. This is the homeworks, the big five wick. Um, this is the vanilla, the not vanilla. This is just the sponge sugar. Um, I'm probably going to start burning this in the next couple of weeks and just leave it out. This is just um, scoopable wax. I'll talk about that in another video. And then down here is like all my bakery, my bakery stuff. So here is um, candleberry, honey buttered, honey buttered rolls. Um, marshmallow embers. I'm trying to um, burn through a candle so I can start that one. And then I've got roasted vanilla cappuccino. Um, this is one of the candles like you have to let this burn at least three to four hours if not longer for it to totally pull out. Um, but it does have a nice smell, uh, smell nice smell to it. Um, okay. So I've got marshmallow mornings. Um, I have two of those. I have the lava cake, um, yummy chocolate donut worry. I've got the vanilla cone. This is all Kringle country candle. I have kettle corn. This one is my third jar. Um, this is just so yummy. I love the kettle corn. And then this is part of the new reserve line right here from Kringle. So this is the sweet and savory. This one I am having a hard time enjoying only because, um, I feel like I'm smelling cat pee. I feel like I'm smelling cat pee. Even though when I do read the um, the scent notes, it's talking about baked bread. Um, so sweet and savory, but for some reason when it's burning, um, I kept thinking that my cat had decided to go crazy and pee around the chair <laughs> that I was sitting in. Um, it just, it was weird. So I think maybe um, I'm gonna, you see I didn't even burn through a whole lot of it. Um, I might try and burn it again with and put into my brain that it's baked bread and see if that changes it. Sometimes mindset. Um, I have the, the macaroons. I have the sinful. I've got a juicy strawberry. I'm excited to, I'm excited to smell that one when it's on burning. Um, dark as night. This is a cologne smell. I don't think I'm going to burn this one. I might actually give this to my other daughter. Um, she does like cologne smells. So I might do that. Um, and then jelly donut. Um, Mr. Kong's mom on YouTube, she just raves about this and I am excited to, I'm excited to burn this, um, but lucky for me, I'm not on a time crunch and when I have to burn it. <laughs> so I'm waiting, um, I'm waiting for it to not be so wintry, I guess you could say. It doesn't make sense. Once again, I'm going to say it, Stephanie Logic, that makes sense to me. Um, okay, so here is the rest of these are all going to be my homework. So um, I've got a coconut cake, which I am extremely excited to to burn. I, I love all these smells. Um, I'm really hoping that when 
um, I burn them, I get really great throw. That would be fantastic. Um, so we've got down here, I've got my lemoncello cupcake, which smells amazing. For some reason, I am in a lemon, pink lemon kick. When it comes to my me um, ordering candles or craving stuff, it's weird. Um, I've got orange creamsicle down here. I've got strawberry, what is that? Strawberry glazed cupcake, another orange creamsicle. Um, this is part of the Valentine's Day collection. Be mine. Another be mine. And then two of, what's this called? This is called the Holiday Rainbow Candy, uh, Holiday Ribbon Candy, sorry. Um, this one, it's just, it's a candy smell, whether it's holiday or not. It's just a, there's, I'm going to burn it when I want to burn it. Um, and then here we have the glass jars. This one is the, um, I think it's the caramel, caramel popcorn. Yeah, caramel popcorn. So I have two of those. Um, I have a sugared, sugared beignet and part of the hobnail. I think it's the hobnail collection. Um, and then back here. So back there is another of the sugared beignets. And then here is the caramel toffee swirl. Super yummy. Um, I've already burnt through one of those. Put that back. All right. And then let me get comfortable here. Okay. And then up here, they're like, some of them are three deep. Um, crackling fireside. This has nothing to do with baked goods, but it's very cozy and it's something that I enjoy burning like fireside or anything like that with baked goods. It just has a cozy vibe. Like I'm inside a cabin, which I'm not. This is not a cabin. Um, oh, and there's my, there's puppy. Hello. That is Thorin. Um, okay. So we've got sandalwood fig, partridge in a pear tree, super light. Not one of my favorites. Um, actually, I might, I'm probably going to give that to my mom, so I'm going to keep that out. Um, another sandalwood fig. That one's definitely a good fall, good fall scent. Um, so here I've got two praline pecans. I've got a maple strudel, another one back here. Um, this is a caramel apple spice tea. This one was okay. Um, I guess I was hoping for more caramel apple. I don't know. I, I gotta be in the right mindset to burn this one, I think. Um, but we'll see what happens. I'll try it again, obviously, since I have another one. Um, this one is, um, oh, I can't really read that. There you go. Sticky bread pudding. This one smelled really good. Then back here, we've got a bourbon pecan pie. And here we go. Fantastic fudge. Another strawberry milkshake. Not another one, but this is a strawberry milkshake. Another fantastic fudge. Um, this is the cookies and cream. I've got... Snickerdoodle, I've got birthday cake, another birthday cake and snickerdoodle. So anything that you see with doubles, um, oh, excuse me, sorry. Um, anything you see with doubles, I have gotten from QVC because they send them in, they send them in doubles. Um, which is this one? Oh, this is a, the berry trifle. And then I've got one, two, three, you can see back there, of the blueberry cheesecake. I have got the 
pink lemonade shortbread two of those i'm so excited to burn these these smell amazing um another um sugared beignets um and the macadamia mai tai i've got two of those two of those so that is it for my candle collection um i do burn one, two, three, four. I burn five candles um, in the morning, Us usually five candles at a time in the morning, um, just interspersed throughout all my downstairs. Um, and then, like I said, then at about 11 o'clock, I move on to my warmers. So there you guys have it. There is my candle collection, and I'm sure I'm going to be obtaining more just trying to pace myself. So that is it. Let me turn and oh, there he is. He's a tired dog. Eh. All right, you guys. <laughs> well, thank you so much for watching. Please like and subscribe. Um, leave a comment. Which one is your favorite candle? Do you have any of these? Um, do you want any like? I'm not giving my candles away, but are there any in here that you plan on picking up or hoping that comes back for next year? Um, for this year, holy smoke, Stephanie. I'm not trying to get this year over with, I promise. Um, yeah, anyways, like and subscribe. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll talk to you later. Bye.